So I know I said that this live stream this month is going to be the biggest one they've shown this year, but holy shit. So to start it off, Steven has confirmed Ashes of Creation's Alpha 2 spot testing has already begun. He stated on Discord that spot testing has begun and some limited NDA testers are participating in spot tests and December we'll see more, including some major headless client testing. Also, those of you that still have the Alpha 1 launcher may see an update in the next couple of weeks. This is not what I was expecting to read today. So basically, what I got out of this is Phoenix Initiative, I would assume, is the ones testing. I could be wrong on this. That is my assumption here. And we're going to start ramping up real soon. I don't even... I was not expecting this. I was not expecting to see any of this today. So, holy shit, that's awesome. I just swore in a video twice. I'm going to get ads removed or something because YouTube is mean. But also, that's not all. Because this artisan stream that we've been talking about... Tomorrow, Steven says on Discord, we'll showcase several changes as we ramp up for Alpha 2, including, but not limited to, updates to the UI for inventory and spatial management, updates to the game lighting and the day and night cycles, skybox and volumetric cloud updates, the processing showcase, the profession skill trees, certification and tool making process, recipe book and crafting stations, corrupt zone updates, adaptive resource ga and gathering tech update, and some ranger skill leaks. That is not just an artisan stream, guys. That is showing huge lighting updates that I assume came with Unreal Engine 5.2's update, maybe even 5.3. I don't really remember where we're at at this point. We're going to see ranger skill leaks, which we got a bit of tease of some ranger abilities in last month's stream, but we didn't see them used. Obviously, we were gonna see processing. I was not expecting to see profession skill trees. That is a huge win right there as well. Recipe book and crafting station is a huge win. We saw a little bit of this in the node showcase, but that is absolutely phenomenal. Corrupt zones we haven't seen since pre-alpha one when they're showing what a corrupt zone is going to look like so that is going to be huge adaptive resource and gathering tech update that's kind of cool but man i would i don't even know what to say i was not expecting this i just saw this on discord and i jumped in here to make a video i didn't even make my bed behind me so holy crap but I don't, I, man, I was, I was disappointed yesterday when we learned that they were not announcing a quarter date this month. But as I said in my stream yesterday, or in my video yesterday, I anticipated something big coming with that announcement. Now it seems that spot testing could be that big thing. If the Alpha 1 testers are getting a launcher update in the next week, couple weeks, then we are right around the corner from getting some pretty big spot testing, I would assume. I still have that launcher downloaded. I hope you guys do. I've been listening to that logging screen, knowing that that launcher will someday bring me joy again. And I, I am ready. I'm ready for this. I am so hyped right now. This is going to be, as I said, the biggest Ashes of Creation stream of the year. Potentially, maybe December is even bigger than this, but this is a lot. We have seen a lot of great stuff this year. We have seen in-depth freeholds, in-depth nodes. We have seen the cleric archetype. We've seen the mage archetype. We've seen story arcs. We've seen so much stuff, and we haven't even seen the best of it yet. That is coming, so stay tuned tomorrow at 2 p.m. I don't even know what the hell to think i i don't even know what's happening i am so excited right now from seeing this stuff after being disappointed yesterday so yeah let me know are you guys excited alpha 2 spot testing is coming right around the corner this is going to be the biggest stream of the year let me know your thoughts in the comments down below and feel my excitement in this weird video i just did but otherwise stay tuned for a lot more to come